Friends, I am excited for our capital campaign generation to generation to get underway here at Clinton Presbyterian Church. And that's not because I like fundraising. I don't. It's because I never tire of hearing and sharing the story about how God has been at work in and through the people of this congregation. It is simply remarkable to recall how for almost two centuries, the people of God have gathered within these walls to worship God, and they've journeyed beyond these walls to serve God and neighbor. From generation to generation, grateful past, promising future, worshiping, loving, serving. This is our story. This is your story. This is God's story. CPC has been a part of our family for nearly 70 years and four generations. We have had ups and downs and all through it, CPC has been our family. We've been there when we had births, when we've had baptisms, when we've had funerals, when we've been at our very lowest and we've been at our very highest. CPC is truly our family. This is such an exciting time for CPC, and I'm looking forward to many, many more wonderful memories with Grant and Quinn growing up in the church and having such wonderful people in their lives. I look forward to many more generations calling CPC their home. Hi there, I've been going to Clinton Presbyterian Church since I was seven years old and it's been such a pleasure to grow up in the church because I've made some amazing memories like when I was younger and I got to go to vacation Bible school or take part in the Christmas pageant. It was so much fun and as I got older and was able to go to Lake Champion, help out with Sunday Fun Day and then I had the amazing opportunity to volunteer with the relief bus. Clinton Presbyterian Church has just given me countless fun memories and great opportunities and it's also given me the chance to meet wonderful amazing people who care for me so much and I'm just really grateful that I got to grow up there. Hi, we are Rick and Leslie Hyman. When we first arrived at CPC almost 30 years ago, we found a vibrant church family worshiping and serving in a wonderful building that had been taken care of by many generations before us. This is truly our church home. And now in our retirement years, CPC continues to be where we choose to serve and to worship alongside our church family. Vacation Bible School, where we met, Family Promise, the Relief Bus, Sunday School, Praise Team, and Packing, Thanksgiving Baskets, and other mission projects are some of the ministries that we hold close to our hearts. We are embracing this capital campaign as a way to ensure that these and so many other wonderful ministries here at CPC will continue in a safe, secure, and beautiful place that draws people together as a family, just as it did us. And we thank you very much for your time. Lisa and I are excited about the capital campaign at Clinton Presbyterian Church, as CPC has been a significant part of our lives for over 30 years. The church and its ministries have enriched us spiritually and have given our family fellowship, friendship, support, and encouragement, teaching us life lessons, not only on Sundays, but throughout the year. We feel that by supporting this campaign, our congregation now, as well as congregations in the future, will have the opportunity to receive the blessings that we've had being a part of the church community. 
and Clinton Presbyterian Church will be able to continue to do its good work. We have surely been entrusted with a rich legacy of mission and ministry. And it is our call now to be stewards of these gifts. Emerging from a time of pandemic, our life together is vital and growing. And the time is right to take these steps. The goal of this capital campaign is to revitalize our building in ways that will better equip us for mission and ministry in the years to come. There are sanctuary repairs, not only the ceiling repair, which has already been completed, but also repair of the stained glass windows. Exterior repairs, replacing the roof, and painting the exterior of the building. Improvements related to welcome and accessibility, replacing the handicap accessible ramp and installing signage in and around the building and interior improvements, renovating the bathrooms, kitchens, and classrooms. Our vision brochure previews these projects and we will be sharing more about them in the weeks to come. If you have any questions, please feel free to reach out to any member of the Capital Campaign team directly or email us at generationsforcpc at gmail.com. This is the first capital campaign at Clinton Presbyterian Church since the 1970s, so it's time. And how exciting to have this opportunity in our time. Over these next weeks, I invite you to say yes to participating in home gatherings, to learn more about the role we each can play in helping this campaign to be a wonderful success to the glory of God. And please join with me in praying for our church, for our church leadership, and for the Capital Campaign Leadership Team over these next weeks. As we each find our place in God's unfolding story, may we join our voice with the psalmist saying, Great is the Lord, and greatly to be praised. One generation shall laud your works to another, and shall declare your mighty acts. May it be so.